Lizzo Coy is going to be quite a challenge. Real age 45, pole age 51. We are going to have to do everything in our power to take her from looking like cave woman to suave woman. Let me bring her in so you can see what I'm talking about. Jan! The most striking thing about her face is her eye bags. They make her look A, older and B, very tired. Mm. You can see that there's a sort of sausage mm. above her mm, can, yeah. top lid. Uh, and that yeah. is exactly the same as here in the lower eyelid. So you have to do both, otherwise the result is not going to look the best. Yes, right. Is there anything Liz could have done to prevent these eye bags? Absolutely nothing. This is a condition that you are very often born with and they progressively get worse as your skin gets weaker, they become much more apparent. And so is the only solution surgery? I'm afraid so. Mm. Ruby! Well, she's got fantastic, beautiful eyes. Look at the colour of them, they're very unusual. What I'd really love is to really push those eyes mm. out because I think no one's actually looked at the beauty of her mm. eyes because of this horrendous mm. thing. And, you know, you'd use mm. something like false eyelashes mm. and, I mean, in extreme cases, you can have an eyelash perm, <laughs> you know, to get it all mm. tilting up. And I think it's got quite good skin tone, although maybe exfoliating a little bit more just to give you a bit more of a brighter, more uniform mm. look. Thank you, Ruby. Guy. Look at this. This really is a hideous head of hair. I don't it's think I've ever heard you say that, so it must be pretty bad. Um, and it is pretty bad, but the colour is obviously the story here. We have grey hair. Now, how do you disguise grey hair? What's the best thing? Do you go darker? And obviously you've had a go of that, but obviously somebody mm. tipped your head upside down when they did it. Or do you go lighter? Two total opposites, but both of them equally unflattering. Mm -hmm. The light and the dark, neither of them work. What we have to do is we have to remove all this colour and just get it to an even mm. base colour. We've got to find the right shade that's going to be flattering.